Hello everybody! In today's video, you will see how to create your own sticker pack in Viber, a popular messenger. If you need to recover deleted data, view or restore removed browsing history, Hetman Software Products will help you. Follow the link in the description, download the necessary program for free, install it and analyze the disk. The utility will show you the data you can recover, so you will be able to view it or get it back. In our channel and blog you will find solutions to any problem, from installing an operating system or configuring it to fixing possible bugs and errors or optimizing mobile gadgets. Our specialists will answer any questions you ask in your comments under the videos or articles. Now, Viber offers a new feature – you can create your own sticker packs. It means you can turn any photo, meme or phrase into, a sp into special stickers and send it to a chat with another user so that you can express your emotions without any words. At the moment, this feature is available on Viber for Android only. If you are using this messenger on PC or iPhone, you will be able to receive such stickers in a chat, forward them to other users or download them from the sticker market. And the goal of this video is to find out what exactly you should do to create a sticker pack of your own. So, let's begin. In order to create your own sticker pack, open Viber, More, Sticker Market, tap Create Stickers button in the upper right corner next to the gear icon. Make up a name for your sticker pack so we can find it easily later. Add a description to always know what it is about. This is particularly important for public packs. The first sticker you create will be the pack's thumbnail in the sticker menu. One more thing is to decide if you want this pack to be public or private. Now, let's have a closer look at creating a sticker of your own. Tap the plus button and choose from the three, from the three options – gallery, camera or just doodle. Let's put first things first. Tap gallery, find a photograph and select it. Now you can edit the photo or add various elements. Magic wand – remove the background, use your fingers to change the photo's angle or zoom and focus on a particular detail. With the text button you can write anything on your stickers. Tap stickers to add stickers from Viber's collection. Use doodles to add your own freestyle shape, picture and text. When your sticker is ready, tap Save. Each pack can have up to 24 stickers, and you can create no more than 20 packs. Any sticker can be edited or deleted. You can do it at any time, but only before the sticker is published. Editing after publication is not supported. Tap the X icon at the top of any sticker in the pack page to delete it. Tap on any sticker to edit it. When you are finished with making stickers, the last step is publishing them. Tap Create Pack at the bottom of the screen to publish your pack. Remember, as soon as you create a sticker pack, it can't be edited. Before publishing, double-check everything and then tap that button. After publication, your sticker pack will appear in the sticker menu. In order to send a sticker, open the menu and find it on the list. Open it and click on the sticker you want to send. That's all. Now anyone on Viber can see and receive your stickers and send them to other people. To send stickers from a computer, they should be uploaded into the messenger first. Do it by clicking on this icon and opening the sticker panel. Now click the arrow up to display all your sticker packs. If you want to add the sticker packs you created to your Viber for desktop, click on the Sync button. When everything is synchronized, you will be able to use them from your computer as well. As you may have noted, any sticker pack can be created as public or private. You can let other Viber users access your sticker pack or close access to it only when you create this pack. When it's published, you can't change anything. If you choose a private sticker pack, you can use its stickers in any chat, but no one else except you can see the whole pack. However, anyone who receives a sticker from a private pack can forward it to another chat. A public pack will have a unique link. 
Any other user will need this link to download the pack. This is how you can share a link to a sticker pack with friends and family. Send a sticker from the pack in the chat, and other people in this chat can tap on the sticker to download the pack. Or send the direct link to the sticker pack to any user you prefer. Now, how can you download a sticker pack created by another user? First of all, it should be public. Secondly, you should either receive a sticker from this pack or a direct link to the pack. When you tap on the sticker, you will be redirected automatically to the page where it can be downloaded. Every sticker pack is assigned a unique link. To let other users download it, share this link with the people. User-created packs in Viber are absolutely free of charge. You can create, download or use them without any payments. Any sticker pack you created can be deleted easily. However, the packs downloaded by other users will remain in their collections. In order to delete a sticker pack, open the sticker menu, tap the gear icon or open Settings, Sticker Market, the gear icon. Before you do it, remember that deleting it from Viber is a one-way street, and you can never get it back. No one else will be able to download it. However, anyone who has downloaded the sticker pack before will still have it in their collection. It may take as long as two hours to have the sticker pack deleted. If you are planning to change to a new phone and worry that your special sticker packs may be gone, calm down. They can be downloaded to their new device easily. Tap More, open the sticker market, then touch Settings. Scroll to the bottom of the screen and tap Restore my stickers to have your stickers packs downloaded to the new phone. If your sticker pack is a public one, you can download it from the sticker market by following the direct link. By the way, if you are about to change to a new phone, visit our channel for a good video tutorial about moving data from an old device to the new one. Check the link below, as usual. And that is all for now. I hope this video was useful for you. Remember to click the like button and subscribe to our channel. Hit the bell button to receive notifications and never miss new videos. Leave comments to ask questions. Thank you for watching and good luck!